Okay, hello and welcome to this video. In this video, we want to I want to show you how you can create a local user account without a Microsoft account in Windows 11. And we will try two ways. The first one is a settings app and the second one is a command prompt. Everything I described here in this video is also written down here in this blog post. Just click the link below in the video description. Well, okay, what's the problem creating a local user account without a Microsoft account? Well, the point is that Microsoft really wants you to use a Microsoft account for your Windows system and also for additional user accounts. So if we go to the settings app and click on the accounts section here, we can create another user account on the system by clicking accounts, other users, and then add the account here. And as you can see here, it states Microsoft account. And what Windows really wants is that we use a Microsoft account and enter email address or phone number. But we can click this link here. I don't have this person's sign-in information. Obvious, isn't it? And after that, Microsoft wants us to create a Microsoft account. So Microsoft or Windows will not give up that we use a Microsoft account. However, we can click this link here, add a user account without a Microsoft account. And once we have done that, we can now create a local user account. We can enter the username, we can enter a password, and if we click next, we have the option to select some recovery mechanism or recovery questions for the local user account. But at this point here, you can now create a local user account. I will cancel this here and we will do the same on the command line. And the command line is a much quicker way to create a local user account. So let's have a look here. So what we need to do here is uh, open a command prompt. Open the start menu, hit enter CMD. And the important thing is run it as administrator. Here we go. And then we can create a local user account with the following command, net space user space. Then we enter the username, in my case, Andy. Then we enter the password. For example, I will just use password here. And slash add at the end. Hit enter and the command completed successfully and our user is now created. And we now have an additional user named Andy with the given password, password here. The password, of course, can be changed later by the user himself. Let's have a look to the settings app. And we are now here in the account user section here. And currently the user does not show up. So we have to just refresh the list here. Go to accounts, other users. And as you can see here, now the user account is created. And as you can see, it's a local account. The default account type is, well, it's a standard user. He has not administrative rights, but you can change it here if you want to. And if you also want to, you can remove the user here by hitting the remove button. Just um, to be clear, you would delete the account and also the data if there is any data in the user folders. And well, that's it. That's how you create a local user account in Windows 11.